welcome to the mathematics in my channel today we are going to solve another interesting question find the square root okay uh, this is difficult to read uh, however first I'm going to take uh, this is equal to k and um, now I'm going to square both sides so we can write k square is equal to uh, now um, here we have one, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one, seven times, and here eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Also, we have eight, seven times. Okay, now um, we have one, seven times. So one, 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 three, four, five, six, seven, and here zero, and eight, seven times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, uh, 6, 7, and here 9, uh, divided by, um, now in the denominator we have 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, so also in the denominator we have a pattern, and here 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and now we can subtract 2, so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now, uh, 7, 6, 5, 4, uh, 3, 2. Now, 3 minus 2, we know 1. Okay, then, um, now, uh, uh, in the numerator, uh, we can write uh, by using uh, sum of 3 numbers. So we can write here we know 1 7 times so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 and then here 0 and we know here we have 8 7 times so I'm going to write 0 0 0 4 5 6 7 and here 9 so also I'm going to write 0 plus now uh, 8 7 times uh, within this number so 8 uh, we know 8 times so we can write 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 then plus we have we have 9 so plus 1 okay now uh, in the denominator we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 well now we know this fact uh, if we multiply 11 times 11 we know we have 1 2 1 and also if we multiply 1 1 1 by 1 1 1 1 so we will have here 1 3 times so 1 2 3 then 3 2 1 uh, also if we have 1 4 times times 1 4 times now here we have 1 4 times so here 1 2 3 4 3 2 1 okay then uh, according to this pattern uh, we will have here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so we can write 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 now we know uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so 1 8 times times 1 8 times okay now here we can write uh, 1 8 times multiplied by 1 8 times so we can write 1 1 1 3 4 5 6 7 8 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay then um, here we have one seven times now uh, I'm going to write one seven times here one two three four five six seven and now I'm going to multiply by nine and divide by nine so we can write nine now nine seven times so one two three four five six seven divided by 9 okay then um, we know uh, 
10 minus 1 is equal to 9 also 10 square minus 1 is equal to 99 also 10 cube minus 1 is equal to 999 now here 2 so 9 2 times here 3 so 9 3 times now we want to uh, 9 7 times so we know we can write 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 9 uh, 7 times we can write 10 raised to the 7th power minus 1 so here now we can write uh, 10 uh, raised to the 7th power minus 1 times now here we have <coughs> 0 9 times so we should multiply by 10 raised to the 9 power then here plus uh, now 8 8 times so we can take 8 uh, as a factor so 8 times now we have 1 8 times uh, if we take 8 as a common factor so we have 1 8 times so 1 8 times we can write uh, 1 8 times also we can multiply by 9 so we can write um, 10 raised to the 8 power 10 raised to the 8 power minus uh, minus 1 ah uh, here uh, we should divide by 9 so here uh, over 9 and also here divide by 9 and here then plus 1 okay then here we have 1 uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 1 8 times so 1 8 times also we can write uh, we know according to this theory 1 8 times uh, here we have we know this is equal to uh, 10 raised to the 7th power minus 1 and here we have uh, 1 7 times so now we have 1 8 times so we can write uh, sorry here over 9 so 10 raised to the 8th power uh, minus 1 over 9 times uh, also here 10 raised to the 8th power minus 1 over 9 <coughs> well now uh, here 9 9 and we know this 9 uh, get cancelled and now uh, we have we can write uh, 10 raised to the 7 power times 10 raised to 9 power so 9 plus 7 we know 16 power so 10 raised to the 16 power uh, minus 1 times so minus 10 raised to the 9 power uh, plus uh, 8 times 10 raised to the 8 power here minus 8 plus uh, here 9 minus 8 plus 9 we know plus 1 so plus 1 over uh, here now we have 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 so we can write 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 square and here uh, 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 over 9 so we should multiply by 9 okay then um, we can write I'm going to write here this place 10 raised to the 16 power so 10 raised to the 16 power and now uh, in these two terms I'm going to take minus 10 raised to the 8 power as a factor so if we take minus 10 uh, 10 raised to the 8 power as a factor we know here we have only 10 uh, minus now here 8 uh, plus 1 uh, times 9 over 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 square okay now we can simplify 10 raised to the 16 power uh, 10 minus 8 we know 2 so minus 2 times 10 raised to the 8 power plus 1 uh, times 9 over 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 square okay then um, we can write now uh, we know this is equal to 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 square times 9 over 10 raised to the 8 power minus 1 square 
now we know this part get cancelled and we will have 9 so we know k square is equal to 9 uh, here we we are going to elevate a square root so we should take uh, plus mark so k is equal to 3 okay if you like this video please subscribe this channel thank you for watching